Miss International is effectively a male beauty pageant. Hi, I'm uh, Ryan Terry, I'm 22 years old and I'm from Worksop. Ryan Terry, Great Britain. It's Mr. Great Britain and Mr. International. And every year, this event would select the best male participant from all over the world. It's a very big event. The event I took place in this year, what there was over 40 countries. Hingga mampu mengharumkan nama negaranya di kancah internasional. Great experience, first time in doing that, so a bit nervous, but absolutely brilliant so far. I get a lot of uh, stick for it being a male pageant because of me being training in, in an environment where it's very, very masculine inside the bodybuilding. Yes, so I get a lot of stick for, for it being a, a male pageant. The world's changing, everyone's seen Coming from uh, a plumbing background, obviously, I, it was very, very new to me. Um, but it was it was an amazing feeling, but it was very nerve-wracking. Thank you. Good timing, Great Britain. I wanted to, to test how far I could go. The other contestants, when I saw them, um, they're, they're famous in their own right, and they are very well-established models, so I wanted to see if I, I could go up against them. Mr. International 2010 goes to Great Britain! So so unreal when I won the uh, the title. It was just a life changing experience. Um, I've not looked back since. It's just been onwards and upwards, and this year since then has just been absolutely crazy. On this stage. Off the back of winning the title, um, I got approached from from numerous companies. Um, a lot to in the sports world, which was very beneficial to me because I really, really, really enjoy sports. And I'm lucky enough and fortunate enough now uh, that I got sponsored by uh, a big, big company called USM. So, yeah, it, it's been very, very life-changing and very hectic and hopefully set me up for quite a while now. I do promote a healthy lifestyle um, and I am very orientated in training and I give out advice on on how I train and how I get the way I get uh, body-wise, looks-wise. So, in all, I do do all parts of modeling, but I, I enjoy and I really like to go down, down the sports modeling sector. Obviously, coming from a plumbing background, I didn't know the first thing about the sultry look and all the posing and all the different kind of looks. But um, yeah, they do. It's amazing when you work with different photographers, how they work. And every, the more you do the, the shoots and the more you, you do in this industry, the more experience you get and the more you, yeah, you feel more comfortable around it. The more you experiment and you see what works and what doesn't work. And uh, yeah, you can easily pick things up, definitely. At first, I mean, it was really, really uncomfortable for me because I've, I've never done anything like that. But um, now I kind of look at it as an achievement because I train so hard and because I, uh, I do look after myself as much as I can. So to show it off a bit, which, yeah, it's nice, it's kind of nice, I enjoy it. I recommend this to anyone, I think it's very doable. It does take a lot of hard work, it does take a lot of dedication more than anything. You've got to be strict with yourself, you've got to be disciplined and you've got to um, shy away from the junk food I'd say. Because I do believe the more, more importantly than training is, is the food side, is the nutrition side. So yeah, it is very doable but you've got to have the discipline, definitely. <laughs>